Newcastle United, known for their exceptional defensive performances in the league, find themselves facing a crucial challenge, an urgent need for depth at the centre-back position. While Sven Botman and Fabian Schaar have been reliable starters, the Magpies' defensive lineup lacks cover, with only Dan Byrne and Jamal Lascelles available as backups. However, hope is on the horizon as renowned football journalist Fabrizio Romano has shed light on two potential transfer targets that could bolster Newcastle's defensive ranks, Antonio Silva and Edmund Tapsoba. Silva, a prodigious 19-year-old centre-back hailing from Benfica, has swiftly made a name for himself. Already an established international player representing Portugal, this towering 6 feet 2 defender played a crucial role in Benfica's title-winning campaign during his first full season. Additionally, Silva was a proud member of the Portuguese squad that competed in the illustrious Qatar World Cup. Drawing comparisons to renowned former Benfica stars such as Luizão and Ruben Dias, Silva's potential for excellence and impact on the pitch is undeniable. Meanwhile, Tapsoba, a 24-year-old defender plying his trade at Bayer Leverkusen, brings a wealth of experience and skill to the table. Representing Burkina Faso on the international stage, Tapsoba embarked on his professional journey at Vitoria de Guimarães in Portugal, before making a significant move to Germany in 2020. Having already spent three fruitful years as a first-team player, Tapsoba played a pivotal role in guiding Xabi Alonso's side to a commendable sixth-place finish in the league and a memorable Europa League semi-final appearance last season. Romano, a trusted source for transfer news, expressed Newcastle United's keen interest in both Silva and Tapsoba. However, he highlighted a potential obstacle that could hinder these deals from materializing, the financial fair play regulations. Romano acknowledged the immense admiration Newcastle has for these talented centre-backs, but emphasized the complexities arising from the financial fair play situation. The financial constraints imposed by financial fair play make the acquisitions of Silva and Tapsaba dauntingly expensive endeavours for the club. In order to navigate this challenging terrain, Newcastle would likely need to offload a player of equal value to balance the books, an intricate and arduous task, to say the least. And did you know of the shocking things Bruno Guimaraes went through? Click the video on screen to find out.